Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel. And uh, one of the big changes coming to Windows 11 that I think a lot of people, including me, will enjoy is that you will be able soon to use multiple apps with the same camera. So what happened is that for a long time, Windows didn't have any powerful enough hardware anyways to share the same camera with different apps then you know the hardware became more powerful and that need actually started to evolve now there's third third party software that do enable that possibility but they are dreadfully slow and um, now it seems that in 24h2 at some point we'll have this new option which is multi-app camera so this will apparently um, work better than what it was before. They've changed some of the API that actually controls the camera input. And um, so in a near future, you'll finally be able to use several apps with the same camera um, and not have too much of a drawback in performance on the system. So this is kind of cool. Um, this is something I've wanted uh, for a long time to be something that could work well uh, so that you know sometimes you might want to stream and stream on different platforms at the same time with the same camera uh, and you know up to now those that do it well the way it works it also impacts performance and output of the camera video but now this seems to be a better option that's coming to windows directly and uh that is definitely something useful for a lot of people. Um, so a lot of people were thinking that, you know, not using multiple cameras was because of um, the um, or spying or, you know, anything like that. It's not the case at all. It's really just that Windows own camera control was unable. So you'd get a message that says, um, you know, no, you, you got to close the other app before you use the camera on this app. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.